In this lecture, we'll learn how to do peak and baseline. So when you come to analysis and you see peak and baseline. So before we start, I have pulled up the XPS file. I've once again attached it as a resource to this class so or to this lecture. So make sure you have it. So let's just select any the first two and head to analysis and peak and baseline. So from peak and baseline, let's come to peak analyzer and open dialog. So we have something like this. Now, this dialog tells us what we want. It tells us that define a baseline, find an integrate peak. So what is the goal? Do you want to just integrate peaks? Do you want to create a baseline? Do you want to subtract baseline? Do you want to find peaks or do you want to fit peaks? So you kind of have to choose a goal from this side. So let's say we just want to subtract a baseline because let's say you have a plot and you don't you want to plot this leveled and show all the peaks. So let's say this peak is hanging, but you want everything leveled over here. So you want to find a base line for the plot. So let's just do subtract a baseline and we've already chosen a b as our input so go to next and you kind of have to follow along so what's the baseline mode so already if it's a constant you just select this as your baseline so you can maybe choose let's say mean and this is the mean of the figures and this will be your baseline so it will just subtract everything and bring it down or if you want a maximum or whatever you can also customize it as you want but we don't want that we want xps so this is xps data origin helps us with that we are fortunate that origin adds xps baseline for us but you can choose whatever one that you need over here okay and then just move to next and it gives us some of the functions computational range so you can go in and play along with it and choose the final height and all so you go to next and you can choose where the new data goes to so uh, you can just do subtract also and see how it look like and you can hit finish and you are done you have your results over here so let's go back to this and pick and baseline pick analyzer open dialog yeah we can do some more you can you can let's say find peak or fit peak okay so let's do fit peak so it will so the goal will be that it will it will do all these baseline subtractions and and find and fit peaks for us so it has found peaks in the di in the plot range for us so let's head over to next and then we can also choose whatever that we need um, over here so let's just go with let's try something else let's try endpoint and head to next and this is not so good so let's see let's just play along and you can do subtract now so if this is something that you need depending on your data you can go ahead and do that so let's go back and you can also you can also select a portion of your data and just do that so let's do create baseline so this is the goal is that we are going to create a baseline so we'll go to the baseline mode we'll create baseline and then we finish so let's head to next and you can choose whatever date whatever that you want if you want to define yours you can do it i would suggest that always because this this is xps um it's already inbuilt because most people do this with xps but you can always come in and go to user define and choose your own baseline so just select the point 
so let's say you choose user defined and you can choose any of these so when you choose you see the changes let's just stick with this and you can also add smoothening to it you can also do this so this is you've enabled auto find and the number of points is eight so you have eight you've chose so yeah this also has eight in here and let's head to next so at next what you can do is you can connect by interpolation or you can also connect by fitting and you can adjust whatever that you need over here um over here you can also baseline anchor point you can add some more so when you click add you can let's say double click on this side double click on this side so you can add some more to fine tune it and make it more accurate so this is a baseline this is a baseline and when you click done it adds more points to your baseline you can also select spleen and b spleen and choose your output so let's choose a new workbook hit subtract and this is how it's gonna look like so it gives you this plot where you can plot and have your baseline subtracted so that is a nice tool to also have and know that origin can do that for you